Hey everyone, Jack here, Talk Nerry City. Welcome back to another match day experience. I'm so glad I'm saying that. It's felt like such a long while since we've been at Carrow Road. It has been. Uh, there's been what feels like 17 games against Liverpool in that time, away from home. Uh, but we're back today and it's a big one. It is a real big one down at the bottom of the table. We, of course, at bottom uh, of the table. But, but going up against the side in Brentford who are in turgid form. Uh, we know all about Brentford. We've played this squad and this manager uh, a good few times over the past few seasons. Some really good battles in the championship. We of course beat them in Daniel Farker's final game uh, as Norwich City head coach earlier on in the season. This really is last chance for Loon for Norwich. Um, a really disappointing defeat to Southampton, which kind of felt like it was a nail in the coffin, but you win today and a few results go your way and suddenly you're right back in the mix. So just need a, a big performance. Um, I'm really sensing, I tweeted this earlier, I'm really sensing a Team Pookie masterclass today just to say, Ivan Tony, hello, I'm still here. I'm still here, I'm still scoring goals. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. You may hear I'm a bit, <clears throat> a bit husky at the moment. I've had a bit of a cold this week. It's not COVID, don't worry. Uh, just a bit of man flu, which we all know is uh, one of the worst illnesses out there. Um, but I'm back, <laughs> raring to go, slightly out of breath. Uh, and I'm looking forward to being back at Carrow. It's really quite murky outside, actually. Let's give you a quick little, uh, oh, that's bright. Look at that, oh, beautiful seagulls. Are they seagulls? I'm not sure. I'm sure uh, Chris will be happy to see them. Right, anyway, I've waffled enough. Um, head into Norwich, maybe get a beer, who knows? We'll see what happens. Let's just take the day as it comes. Let's do this, Brentford at home. Come on, boys! Chris, one of the most underwhelming 45 minute performances of the season. I don't know what to say, mate. I'm, I'm really disheartened. Are you that. speechless? I don't know. I'm, 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 I'd like to think that there was injuries in a funny sort of way, considering how our midfield played today. I'm sorry, Chelsea fans. Have Billy back. Billy is not. He, he does is not. Is he no longer the Scottish Iniesta? No, look. Billy's a very talented player. He'll be a great player for Chelsea. He, he, he is not the player for a relegation fight. Playing systems and tactics all day long. But corners are hitting the first man, misplaced passes. And I'm not just picking on Billy, by the way. The whole midfield is championship standard. It's nowhere near Premier League. Even the Tash Normans have enough game today. Pookie feeding off scraps again, the poor bastard. No one's giving him the ball. Basic mistakes. Anything today. to be cheery about? Well, then we're about to move Tampa. <laughs> Come on, the Tampa time. Good by half time. Uh, no, it should. Oh, yeah, it was a pen. Kicked him right in the head. Should have had a penalty this end. <laughs> no, for nothing for VAR. And Brent could go down there and get the penalty. Fuck VAR, yeah. <laughs> this corrupt league. Penalty for Brentford. Ivan Tony already scored once. We all know Tim Krull's penalty record. Come on, Timmy Krull! It's good. Go on, it, Timmy Krull! Will it be good enough? I'd love to see Tony Go on, Timmy Crow. Does he save it? Go on, Timmy Crow. Come on. Come on. Come on, Timmy. Come on, Tim. 
Corps, Thierry yeah. Two down. Gone from bad to ugly quickly. Another penalty to Brentford. Live on Tony on the hat trick. Only Tim Krull in his way. Chances. Milo. Three one down. Sorry, three. Good goal for you, man. Good goal. Brent fan. Brent fan bull. It's too late. But good goal. Something to cheer about. Come on, man. Rob. Offside. Pookie was offside. Fifteen minutes before the goal. Cheer up. Scored. Pookie, mate! I'm just, do you know what? Pookie. I'm so numbed by VAR that I was genuinely expecting a completely legitimate goal to be chalked off again. 3 1, still time. You don't believe he's on. <laughs> Call the boys. Well, that didn't go to plan. Nori City 1, Brentford 3. Ivan Tony, hat trick. Um, Jen's here, she's holding the camera. Hello. First game in a while for you, Gem? Yeah, first game back at Carrow Road since Covid. Um, oh, really? Yeah. Oh, Been dear. to a few of the away games and the cup games, but... That was a, a, a welcome a back to reality. It was then. a real rude awakening, I'm mm. not going to lie. It was just rubbish. We were rubbish. Yeah, we weren't great. Uh, VAR not quite going our way, but sadly another performance that just reeks of averageness and uh, that's championship football basically yeah. confirmed for next season I'm afraid. A real shame because Burnley got battered as well. Yeah. A win today could have really got us catching their tails so uh, not to be. Uh, lots of uh, big talks to come in future months I think mm. uh, about where this football club goes next. But not all is lost. I've got a roast dinner tonight. <laughs> Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you all again very soon. Bye-bye.